What's up YouTube, this is the Prince of ATP 101 and in this video I'm going to show you guys 10 more tweaks that works with the iOS 10.3.3 jailbreak. So if you watch my Goblin jailbreak video, this is just a follow up to that. This is the second one I've made. The links to this other one, the first one will be at the end of this video also with the Goblin jailbreak video. So yeah, I'm just going to show you guys 10 tweaks. I'm not really going to go in depth because most of these tweaks you guys already know. I'm just going to show you that this supported with the new jailbreak or the work so the first one i'm going to show you guys is called app admin app admin basically lets you when you go into the app store download an app you could download an older version than the one that's currently being offered by apple so if i go just a snapchat and this won't work with all apps but it works with some so you can see snapchat right here i could tap on it and also what this does it gives you if there's any tweaks in Cydia that's compatible with this app you could tap on tweak and it will show you a list of all the tweaks that works with snapchat or whatever the app is so that's real cool but to get the earlier version you just tap on there and you could hit downgrade or continue if you wanna download the newest one or you could hit downgrade if you wanna download an older version as you can see right there so that one is called App Admin, and then the second one is called Blurred. If I go back into the App Store, because this is a keyboard one, so if I go back in here, if I tap that, you get that nice dark keyboard right there. And that's all Blurred does, it just gives you a dark keyboard. And then number three is called Status Folder. Status Folder is basically a tweet that's whenever you open up a folder, it shows you your status so if I tap right here you can see everything is blurred out the only thing it shows me is my is the folder but with this one if I tap right here you can see your status and everything with it so that's real cool that one is called status folder and then number four is called round dock you can see the dock down here has a little rounded shape to it it would be cool if they make a a dock like the iPhone 10 for the regular devices just like that I mean so yeah that one is called round dock and you can see the icons in the dock is bouncing that's done with number five called icon bounce you see the icon just bouncing around that one is called icon bounce and then number six is called no slow animation no slow animation is kind of buggy it doesn't work for all the devices kind of a partial one but if you want to speed up your device, you could try it out. It's not as fast as Speed Intensifier, which I showed you guys in the first video. But yeah, no slow animation. It, it's kind of partial. It's partially working. And I also have a link in the description that you could click on it. And it will show you all the tweaks that, that's compatible with this jailbreak. It's a constantly updated tweak, uh, um, tweak list. So you guys could check it out. So yeah, that one is called No Slow Animation. It's kind of... It's kind of um, partially working. And then my number seven tweak is called Swipe Selection. Swipe Selection is basically a real cool tweak that lets you use the keyboard as like a trackpad. So if, I, if I'm typing a, a paragraph and I want to swipe back, all I have to do is just swipe on the key, keyboard. Not, I don't really have to use that, or that magnifying glass to, to do it. I just swipe back and forth just like that. Yeah, and that one is called Swipe Selection. And number eight is a real cool one. This is a must have if you're new to jailbreaking or just with all these jailbreak that's partially complete. It's not a full solid jailbreak out yet. This is a cool tweak to have. It's called Tweak Compatible. Tweak Compatible is basically a tweak that whenever you go in the city and you say so you tap on a tweak, you see that little search bar up top. If you tap on it, it'll tell you if it works with your firmware and the jailbreak that you have on your phone this tweak this package doesn't work just like that so let's go in here let's try app admin okay more information this package works this package doesn't work so you could click on it to tell to basically tell them if it works or not so this is people updating this constantly so you could tap on it and you could say it works just 
just like that so you could I mean you could just set it up if they don't have any information on it it will let you know they don't have any information this is the tweak so you could set it up it will tell you up here this pack this package version has been marked as working based on the feedback from you know what I mean so that's a real cool tweak this is a must have tweak for all jailbreakers right now and number nine is called Spotify history Spotify history is a real cool one because before on Spotify you never had really a history a lot you could go to your search and all that but there wasn't a a good history of all your songs that you were playing on Spotify until now so let it load up so you know you got your regular home but if we go over here to the library right down here at the bottom we have a history and it will show you all the songs that you've been playing only thing is it doesn't work with Spotify plus plus it doesn't work with Spotify plus plus so that's a bummer but if you have the original Spotify on your phone and you're jailbroken you could get Spotify history and it'll show you all the songs you played throughout the history of you know what I mean I just started testing this out so I don't really have a lot of songs but there you go these are all the songs right there a complete list of your history using Spotify so that's a real cool one and number 10 and final tweak is called delete forever delete forever basically if you delete a picture so let's just delete this picture right here usually you delete it it will go to the delete folder then you would have to delete it again if you want it gone off your phone permanently but with this tweak you could tap delete and it says permanent permanently delete photo if you want it gone altogether you hit that if you want to go to your delete folder then you hit delete folder but permanently delete it's gone just like that I could delete this one too gone and if I go to my delete folder where's my delete folder so these are all videos I like my son making videos and stuff like that so you can see the delete folder right there none of that stuff is in there none of that stuff everything is gone so I'll go back out here these are all videos of my son they use these phones when I when I'm not around so let's delete this one permanently in fact let's I'm gonna delete immortal so the red iPhone I just delete permanently let's go to the delete folder it's not there but the immortal you can see because I did delete photo it went right here and there's also a problem with immortal it's kind of partially working that was for my last video but yeah there you go guys it's printed ATP 101 make sure to subscribe and hit that notification and like do everything follow me on snapchat I post a lot of funny stuff over there links in the description also follow me on Twitter if you got any questions hit me up on there peace thanks for watching